What's up guys, Rob from ClicksGeek. In today's video, we're gonna run through Google Ads ad schedule, uh, the best practices, how they work, and some of my experience with all the different clients using them. All right, so what you're looking at right now is inside one of our clients' Google Ads accounts. And if you're looking to find the ad schedule, you would come over to the sidebar here, come down to ad schedule. So we'll open that up and you can see here, let's sort that. They are running Monday to Friday, 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. <clears throat> and you can see here, you can add bid adjustments based on the best days. Or if you have a day that's that's uh, converting higher than most others, like 35% on uh, Mondays, we want more of that traffic so we can do a little 2% bid adjustment. And this is something I do usually, though, like every 90 days. It's not like a weekly optimization tactic. But you can see here, you can set the ad schedule to whatever you want. And how to do that, you come to this blue little schedule pen icon. And you can set Monday to Friday. You can do all days. You can do specific days, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. You can do any day you want. And you can set the times however you want. Now, best advice I can give you when starting out setting your ad schedule is number one make sure you're in the 12 hour clock now what, what I mean by that come up here click this use 12 hour clock and that's how you're gonna see the the regular times if you use 24 hour clock you're gonna do the military time and that can be a little bit confusing so you want to make sure that you guys are in 12 hour clock now here's my experience with with running ad schedules Ideally, you want to have the longest time frame you can from when your ads are running. So 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. These guys are 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. because they don't really care. They they're done. They they're done taking calls at 6 p.m. and um, they don't want calls coming in after six or form submission leads. Now, based on our experience running this campaign and thousands of other ones, leads that come in if you're running a 24-hour ad schedule th that's fine that's good i have lots of clients who do that but they also the guys who do that have call centers set up that can take the calls and the form submission leads and and take the calls and call the form submission leads back and actually book appointments through them now if you're just letting them collect overnight and then you're trying to reach out to them the next morning you're going to run into problems and that's something that we've seen across thousands of campaigns and clients is the people that come in at three o'clock in the morning, one o'clock in the morning, they, uh, they're extremely hard to get a hold of. And uh, it's definitely problematic because you're spending money. I mean, what's this guy's paying here? $51 a lead. So, you know, every, every lead that comes in overnight, it's 50 bucks a pop that you could possibly not get a hold of. So that's why these guys like to run during their normal business hours. Now, if, like I said, if you want to run 24 hours, that's great. Just have a plan. Have some kind of plan that somebody can answer the calls. Somebody can write back the form submission lead and or call them or get, you know, get in touch with them to book your appointment or whatever you're trying to do. That's the best advice I can give you. Other than that, I would say try to stretch your ad schedule as long as possible because Google, Google Ads takes a little bit to ramp up. So th this might turn on at 8 o'clock in the morning, but it's got a little period where it's like ramping up. So you're not going to turn out at 8 and get leads immediately, all right? That's why I always say set it an hour earlier. So if, if it was my campaign, I'd be, I wanted to really get moving at 8. I set it for 7, 7.30, 7 7.20, 7 7.15, something like that. Most likely, I would probably do 7.30. But um, that's that's some some advice you guys can take with you there. And um, try not to do the 8 a.m. to 12 or 8 a.m. to 3. You're, it's just not enough time. You know, at least not in the beginning to get you. So the, the whole point of running your Google ads, obviously, is to get leads and phone calls. But in order to do that, you got to get data. You have to get data first. So try and when you first start your campaign, try and run as much as you can because you got to gather all that data. And then we have to optimize it. If you've watched any of my other videos on how to optimize your campaigns, you need a lot of data to do that. And that weekly optimization whittles down your cost per lead till you're right where you need to be. But in order to do that, you got to. You got to get the data. So that's why I say if you can run it, run as open as you can. Obviously, you know, like I said, don't run 24 hours. Though if you can't do something with those leads that come in at midnight or two in the morning, because they'll just be a waste of time. And to set the ad schedule, like I said, it's easy. You just come in here, you hit add, you choose whatever you want. 
Monday to Friday, or maybe you want to run just a couple days a week, you come over here and you just choose your times you want to run. Pretty straightforward, really simple. There's really not much to this, guys. So if you have any questions, obviously just drop them in the comment section. I'll do the best I can to uh, answer them. But that's all I really got for you today. It's pretty straightforward, and um, just you know, take my advice when I say running overnight, you're going to get, you will get leads, and uh, they're going to be hard to contact in most cases. You know, from what we've seen, they're pretty difficult to contact. All right, so that's all I got for you today. Again, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Check out the links in the description. I put a, some cool stuff in our link tree for you guys, and uh, I'll catch you in the next video.